Blessings everybody. Evangelist Celia here. Disclaimer. Let me point it out very clearly. I am not a prophet. Neither am I a prophetess. I am just a servant of the Lord Jesus Christ. One who avails herself. Try to be obedient to the word of God. So that the Lord can use me however, whenever he chooses to. You do not have to be a prophet or a prophetess to be used by God. The Lord uses anybody, anyone he chooses to use or chooses to speak to. At any given time, even a donkey, the Lord can use. Now, the Lord gave me, I had a vision. After that vision, and I woke up, the Lord gave me a warning for the country of Jamaica. Many will say, how oh, often persons Come and said the Lord, give them a warning. That is not my concern. Neither can I tell anyone how to think or what to say. But all I know is that whenever the Lord speak to me, I know that it is the Lord who is speaking to me. No. The Lord says to tell the people of Jamaica that our children, our children will be going under attack not too long from now. The Lord says that the leaders of this nation who are supposed to be running the country and have the best interests, the country's best interests at heart, they have sold out to the devil because of greed and power. They have opened portals and allowed demonic entities to enter into our island. These demonic entities that have been released are welcome through the portals that have been opened from those that are in power. These demonic entities are after one thing and they are after the youths, the children in specific. A particular set of children. Now, the Lord says for this destruction not to eat, come at your doorstep or to eat your home. You need to seek him, call upon him, seek him while he is near, call upon him whilst he can be found. How are you going to do that? You are supposed to, we, because I am a mother also, are supposed to go on a seven days fasting. Parents, guardians, this is for you. This is for us. Cover your children. Seek the Lord. Put your children before God. Because, because destruction is awaiting them. Seek him for seven days. Seven days. Seek him in prayer and fasting. Put your children before God. Pray. Pray earnestly and ask him for mercy upon your household. There is a darkness that is hanging over. Our children, this darkness, it's not a literal darkness like you can see so that you can see 
Or you can see when the time get dark, night is coming, the time looks dark. It's not a literal darkness. It's not a literal dark cloud. It's a spiritual darkness. And unless you have the spirit of discernment, your spiritual eyes are open, you will not be able to see it. If you are not obedient, if Somehow you come across this message and you choose to ignore it and says every time prophet get warning and they get warning for Jamaica, so be it. But when the cry is made, your house, your house, there will be weeping at your house. The Lord says, there is going to be a increase, a drastic increase in children that are being abducted, going missing. There will be an increase in children being R-A-P-E, children being M-U-R-D-E-R-E-D, -E -E children being abducted because what? Our children, the way oh. This is supposed to all go out. Our children are supposed to become lamb to the slaughter. And they want to destroy our youths, the nation's children, the nation's future, because of greed and power. They will do whatever they need to do to make sure that they have what they see themselves see themselves that they need the power and the money i don't know when you come across this message where it will find you however it will find you but however it finds you you need to be obedient go and fast him fast and pray for your children Cover them under the blood of Jesus Christ. The Lord has spoken. Thus says the Lord. He that hath ears to hear, let him hear. Or whenever this cry is made, not too long from now, then your house is going to be one of those houses that will be lamb to the slaughter. The Lord bless you. May the Lord continue to keep you. The Bible says, Whosoever have ears to hear, let him hear.